What's up? Happy Sunday. So this is tutorial number two for the brand new Google Sheets tool called Live Letter. And this is launching in just two to three days. All right. So what I want for you to do is if you do any sort of disputing, either for yourself or for your clients, and you either want to save money, you want to save time, you don't want to spend a ton of money on credit repair software, whatever it is, then this is a video that you wanna watch. There's a wait list that you wanna join by going down into the description, clicking on the link and joining because guess what? Not only are you going to get early access to this, but you're going to get a discount, all right? So let's move right into this. So this is tutorial number two for this brand new automation app. And I'm actually recording this on my phone to show you how simple this is even to use on a mobile device. All right, so just as I showed earlier, and yes, I know my, uh, audio mix was really weird, so this kind of works out to make a second tutorial. But anyways, we already have our client in here, Bob Dole, as you can see, date of birth, address, social, yesterday's date. You can add notes in here. Now, this is really simple. This is your CRM. You can have however many clients in here that you want. I believe this accepts up to a thousand rows. And you're going to check off which bureaus you want to dispute, Experian, Equifax, and TransUnion, at least for this demo. Now, when we go over to our options page, this is where you're very simply going to choose the letter that you want. Now you can put any type of letter in this box right here where it says custom letter. All right. You can put, and you know what, I'm not hating on templates. So if you want to throw a template in there that says pursuant to something that has nothing to do with anything then Hey, do you, that is totally your prerogative, but I have an actual dispute letter that's going to get results for this client in here. And you can, Otherwise choose from one of the built in options. There's a ton of them and I'm adding even more. All right. So we are sticking with our custom letter. We're going to go down and add our accounts. Now, right here, you would just choose uh, which client you are disputing. Technically, this is number one. So that would say number one. And this bright pink, neon pink, whatever, right here tells you that you are automating. You're automating. Guess why we're automating? Because it saves time and money. There's two things that you can't give back. Technically one, time, right? The second thing, once you spend your money, it's gone. So if you wanna save time and money, then this is a tool that's going to help you do that. And if you can process a dispute letter in less than a minute, how many can you process in a month, in a year? I mean, you do the calculation, all right? So we're gonna automate this and all you have to do is add in your creditor name, the account number. You can choose either from adding in a custom dispute reason, like I was never late, I don't owe X balance, or you could choose one of the disputes that are built in, okay? There's currently 270 items in here, but there's going to be over 300 by Wednesday. All you have to do is choose which bureaus that you want to dispute. And guess what? Right here, if we scroll up, if I click on these buttons right here that says uncheck and check all, it's going to check and uncheck these boxes. So you don't even have to manually do that. Why would we do that when it's going to waste time? Over here, you can see that everything has been added in with all the formulas that I have in here. And we're very simply going to choose a automation. So I'm going to pretend that we're disputing a charge off. So we have charge off round one version A. However, I can choose from any of the other disputes that are in here, like bankruptcy, collection, round one, two, three, four, five, whatever, and it's going to automatically populate a dispute reason for this account. All right, same thing for uh, these other accounts, right? So we have charge off one, two, three, four, five. We have bankruptcy at the bottom. We have things like itemized late payments, missing late payment proof update, missing late payment proof delete, missing proof of ownership, so on and so forth. And because I am automating, that's all I have to do. Choose a round, choose a type, add my creditor, add my account number, and that's it. All right, and then now we're just gonna go print. All we have to do is go over here to client one. That's going to have a different name on the tab. And as you can see, everything is already in here. His information is pulled from the CRM. The bureau is pulled from the CRM. The letter is pulled from options and the accounts. We're going to scroll down just a little bit. The accounts are pulled from the options page. And then that's it. it says, thank you, Bob Dole. Now, as you can see, we have Equifax and then we also have TransUnion. Now, even on mobile, you can print if you are attached to, you know, the wireless or whatever. So I'm actually standing in front of my printer just because it's nice and sunny over here. Um, now, if I wanted to, I can go up here to the top 
right, click on those three dots and go to share and export and click on print, choose my computer and literally print from my phone. But because this dialog box will not show up, even though I'm recording my screen, I'm not gonna show you that. So that's really all you have to do. You don't configure anything on this screen. All you do is make sure that everything is listed correctly and that's it. We created a full dispute letter in less than just a minute. I mean, it, it's technically only about 10 seconds, but um, even if you did not check this box to automate and you wanted to uh, choose one of these reasons or you wanted to enter your own reason, it still goes to say that you are saving a ton of time. All right. So I'm going to go and post this video for you so that you can actually have a good, clear audio and an ability to see exactly what I'm showing you on here. But otherwise, if you wanna join the waitlist, if you are tired of spending money every single month on credit repair software that literally just wastes your time, then hey, join the waitlist, you'll get early access, and not only that, but you're gonna get a discount, and not only that, but you are going to be entered to receive, um, entered for a chance to receive a free copy of this with all of the upgrades that I'm gonna be including, all right? So um, I'm also creating a Facebook uh, group for this and I'm gonna be running a live contest, all right? So join the wait list, join the wait list, join the wait list, all right? Even if it's just to see if you can win one of the free copies that I'm giving out, all right? So anywho, have a great rest of your Sunday. And um, just as a side note, if you are not interested in any sort of automation or credit repair software tools or anything like that, but you wanna see if I can do a credit sweep for you, head over to my740.com, schedule a call with me and I will see if I can help. But for today, that was it on the brand new live letter tool with Google Sheets that I created just for you so that you can be what you want to, you know? like. Well, just so you know, what I mean by that is not tied up in front of your computer all day long and be financially free and spend time with your family or your kids or whatever. I literally built this tool for myself because I was tired of using all of these others, um, all these other tools that make it longer than doing it manually. And I obviously don't want to do it manually. So anywho, I'm going to stop my rant and I'm going to let you go now. So have a great day. Bye.